guys welcome to another budgeting video i am tori and on this channel we are documenting my debt-free journey i hope you enjoy the content so today we are budgeting 1510 dollars and first i like to divide my paycheck in three equal parts savings bills and debt those are my three major categories and everything pretty much falls under those so fifteen hundred and ten dollars divided by three is five hundred and three dollars and so because of the canadian lowest bill is five dollars and i don't like to work with the coins i'll just allocate five hundred dollars to bills five hundred to debt and the extra ten dollars goes to savings so five hundred and ten dollars will be going to savings now to keep now to keep track of my stuffings i like to make a list in this little booklet on the categories that i will be stuffing so these are the subcategories of my major categories so these fall under bills this under debt and here under savings and once i stuff each subcategory i like to mark off those just so it's easier for me to keep track of where i am that being said let's start stuffing okay so now we're gonna start by stuffing bills or bills category and we just use this tray so we have the money separated so we're adding $410 to $440. Let's not get that mistaken. $440 to rent. That should bring our total to $700. So. One, two, three, four, five, six, fifty, forty, seventy, ninety, seven hundred. So we'll go ahead and mark that off. Then we'll add twenty dollars to transportation. And then six and then sixty forty dollars to groceries. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty. And then now we're going to stuff or that. So now we're gonna be stuffing our debt. We pretty much do the same thing where we allocate, we put our money in the tray and then we'll just go by crossing those off. So we're gonna add $230 to our student loan. which would make us have 700. So one, two, 20, 30. One, two, three, four, five, six, 650, 700. Yes, and that's or monthly payment or student loan is in US dollars. So we kind of over budget a little bit just because of the exchange rate. So there it is. And then we'll mark that off and we're adding the rest to our credit card because we're using the debt snowball method of paying off our credit card. And 
that's the last Canadian credit card that we have. Then after we clear that credit card, we'll just have to focus on our US credit card. there and that's it for our debt and now we're gonna move on to savings so now we got our debt and our bills already stuff we're gonna move on to our savings All right so the first one we're gonna be stuffing hundred and seventy dollars to step one and for those of you who don't know, step one, we're following Dave Ramsey's seven step to financial freedom. And step one is to save $1,000 to kickstart your emergency fund. We are at $830 currently in our envelope. So the remainder is $170, which would make our balance $1,000. That means we are finished with step one from that which is a milestone which is really a thousand I count weird <laughs> but it's still counting anyways guys so yay to completing step one And then we're going to add $145 to our emergency fund. Even though step one was to kick off our emergency fund, we were still adding a little bit here and there to the emergency fund. So that's going to be for $500. So we should have 500. So it's one. 45, 20, 30. Oopsie, that does not look cute. Let's try with smaller. For instance, 100. You know what? I'm gonna just put 150 in and take out $5. If that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna put 150 in our emergency fund and take out five dollars so it's 45. yeah so we should have 500 now so yay we're getting somewhere and then we're gonna add the remainder which should be 195 dollars to our savings Which would make us have 195 plus 1,385. We should have $1,580 there. So $1,102,300. 1, 500 and 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80. Is that correct? Yes, 15, 80. And this is a placeholder because we have a thousand in the bank because we don't want to keep too much money on hand. Yes, so there you have it. That's it for today's video, guys. Please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Turn your post notification on just so you'll get notified whenever I post a video. Thanks. Until next time. Bye.